Okay, here's the neighborhood for 474 Rye Creek. We have a pretty big side yard here because it's on a curve. Service yard. Pretty new. So it's kind of pie shaped where it's really big on the front with a lot of space between the houses in the front and sides. Vinyl siding with brick accents. And you can see the pictures to get a better feel for the, the view there. So now we'll head on in, covered entryway. Eight foot doors. Nice uh, treatment here on the foyer entryway. Nice light fixture, smooth ceilings, wood looking vinyl floors. To the right, you have guest bedrooms and guest bath, full bath, and the other guest bedroom in the front. Start there. Nice wide windows, indoor closet. You have a little coat closet here. And then the full bath. Standard six foot eight doors inside the house. Cultured marble and a vinyl insert tub. And then the guest bedroom, number two, again with a door closet. And a little window to the side there. And back out into the foyer hallway. To the left is the utility room and storage closet, additional coat closet. Utility room just big enough for the two. A washer and a dryer. And the garage in the back. Lots of storage, shelving around the edge, golf cart. Standard two car garage. Pretty good size. Okay, back into the foyer. Let's look at the front door. So you can see that again in that foyer entryway. Nice spacing there. Nice artwork. I'll back up again as we'll walk into the great room area. Pardon all the shakiness and I go up and down to try, try to give you as much feel as we walk into the kitchen area. There's the center island, nice and big. And the breakfast Dining room area, it has built, well, it's not built in, but yeah, maybe built in seating around the edge there. Then you have your living room. And a screened in porch in the back, plus a patio. You have a nice big uh, grill in the back there. Stainless steel and brushed nickel. Here's your pantry. It's kind of deep. You have your drawers. Let's see. Standard drawers, not soft clothes. And not soft clothes on the cabinets, but they are 42 inch cabinets. And of course it's like new and it is gas. So it's kind of hitting all those buttons there. Quartz countertop, single sink. We'll go into the master bedroom. Nice size, looks out over the back view. We'll see that in just a second. It's kind of wooded area and then other homes beyond that. So pretty good separation there for privacy.
and it pinches in the back so the people in the each side of you you know it's a little bit tighter in the back here you get the broader front view so this is a king size bed that's in here so it's a good space you have a walk-in closet here to the right and then you have the water closet or that's what we call it the toilet area you have one sink here with the mirror you have the other sink separated with your little linen closet in between and then you have a walk-in shower and this has a, a vinyl five foot insert shower it has a nice shelving and all then they added their little apparatus there for handheld that this window is a little steamed and maybe fogged and this is tile in here which goes on into the bathroom and carpet in the master bedroom and the luxury vinyl flooring in the living room area okay do a quick walk out on the back porch concrete have a standard small enclosed screened in porch area with the vinyl siding the neighbors next door the little common area there that will grow up pretty quickly and then a little grill patio area here you do have electric box in the back and you can fence in the back here if you had a pet so that wouldn't be that would be a good thing to do. And come back out over here on the side and see. Here we are looking back towards my vehicle. This is a new area too. So there's your hose bib have access for the hose if you want to put some plants and all and this is the back neighborhood here other than being a little bit tight in the back this is a pretty nice setup and the house is of course in really nice condition that screen's not so maybe they have a pet too not sure what would have caused that Now here's view from the back slider. So master in the back, you have two guest bedrooms separated in the front, two car garage, island, gas, pantry, and wide open area here. So it's pretty simple floor plan, very well done, and reasonably priced for this market, so it probably won't stay very long. We got decorated pretty nicely too. A little pop up here to go for the air handler. And that's about it. So, hope you like it. Give me a call.